This is the Yu-Gi-Oh! Nuzlocke, the 27th sealed series on YouTube. Nuzlocke is a term that comes from Pokemon, a remake of the classic childhood favorite, Pal World. In this series, the rules are simple. You create a new Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel account, thus artificially inflating the popularity of this game on Steam charts, and pick one single bundle from the store, just like picking your starter Pokemon. This one is Charizard. From here, you likely unlock a bunch of secret packs. This will be your archetype of choice, wherein you will purchase 10 further secret packs. Every time you lose a Pokemon or it faints, it is released into the wild permanently. This is to mirror the system of American healthcare. Don't you have health insurance? I'm on a budget here, bro! Here's the fun part. If you lose, you randomly dismantle a card from your deck. One win, one pack. Three wins in a row, craft a card. Five wins in a row, undismantle a card, and on a new tier rank up, 10 packs or a bundle. No starter cards, no solo mode rewards. It's time to g catch them all or something. You do! Welcome back to episode two of our Nuzlocke series. This is where we're kicking things off here. We've got a lot of dismantles. Yes, we've lost a lot of cards. We've lost uh, Night Dragon Lich. Pulau, Swanee, Blackout, our Imperm, our Imperm bundle card, and Fists of the Unrivaled Tenyi. So yeah, we're in a we're in a bit of a situation right now. Anyway, I think the deck is still in a pretty decent position, all things considered. It's a bit unfortunate we don't have more like Vishudas and Adharas, or I guess Ashunas should probably be the thing here. So we're kind of just relying on this Yangzing package that is very counterintuitive with the Yangzing creation. Uh, we obviously noticed that very early, so hopefully that's not going to be too much of a problem going forward. The journey continues. <laughs> Drawing Mare Mare. Is that good? It's probably fine. My opponent has five extra deck cards. I'm I'm confident. I'm actually really confident here. Oh, we're fine. This is the bronze gameplay I've been waiting for, dude. Oh no, it's uh, zombie control though. Who's that cards? Oh, Ashuna Vashuna. That's game. All right, let's begin by special summoning the Ashuna here. Oh my God, does he have Maxi? Whoa, Zoma the Spirit. Zoma! We got Ashuna here. Oh, what the hell is that? Ha! Huh? Enma's Judgment. When your opponent specials, I'm also destroyed. Then you can banish five zombies and then special level seven or higher zombie from your deck. It's fine, though. I'm gonna get Vishuda here. Almost summon you. And then we go for some nice Shahasarara plays. My opponent gave me an Enema. Yeah, okay, buddy. Special summon you back. What the heck? All right, let's go for it. Uh, let's get an Adhara out the deck here. Get an extra body recycle. All right, Adhara recycle the, this back. And now, I think we go for the big man. All right. Activate the effect here. Now the question is, do I need to Vashuda bounce this Gozuki? Because it has an effect here. Card is sent to the grave, banish a zombie from your grave, except itself it's special zombie from your hand. Do we have a zombie in the grave? We do not, we don't actually care about it, nice. Declare the effect of Shaman. Shaman gets to destroy you. Uh, replay, continue the attack here, and then we just punch. Ah, thousand damage, how? All right, sick. Big plays here, our opponent is not coming out of this one, my guy. Uh, nothing else to make here, right? Normal summon Zombie Master. Discarding Nine-Tailed Fox. I am legitimately scared right now. Nine-Tailed Fox, Tribute to Monsters, Special Summon this card here. Figuring the Gozuki here, Banishing to Special Back. Oh, what the hell is that? Shooting Doji. Doji. Not a Synchro, though. Well, this is so easy. We've got this. Effect. Yeah, okay, pop this. And then chain this to gain a 22 token. Easy. Uh, Special two Fox tokens. Okay, there goes Monk. Heck by Monk. All right, that's easy. Activate the effect here. Gain a token. All right, let's just go battle phase here. It's me! Easy clap. That's a victory for us. So, Do we get packs for winning? I don't remember. <laughs> One single master pack for our victory. Is it ultra rare? This is going to unlock a secret pack for us, which we can then go into if we get another victory. See the knock-on effect we get here. Chaos Sorcerer. Might be worth playing. Ultra rare Cheruveni. We can go into the BA pack. Okay. DDD Seeker, uh, Trias, Harkia, Dark Spirit, Greed. Should be the Dark and Draw too. Uh, Seer, Target, Dante, Dante, Target, Seer. Are we down for that again? Um, this is 
What could we do with this hand here? Kind of awkward because we have creation. Special Nahata, make a link. Normal summon Chai Wen. Like, probably fine. Let's get that monk on the field so that it doesn't conflict with the creation. Normal summon Chai Wen. Uh, I don't think I'm going to bring back Swanee. I think I'm going to bring back the uh, Nahata and make a Link monster. And that way I get to use the Shaman effect to trigger to destroy a card when he attacks. Because he's probably not going to read what Shaman does. Damn it, there's that Imperm we were worried about. No, not real hand traps! Alright, uh, well, good thing we got we went through our Link monsters here. Because we, uh, we just play Synchro Control now. Please do not normal summon Snake Eye Ash. Okay, it's a Sword Soul structure deck. Monk. Tank is declared involving your face-up non-effect. Oh, come on. Please tell me the, the, the Sword Soul structure deck does not come with a uh, Baron the Floor. Wow, this is really looking bad here. Oh god, it's Cheng Ying. No, we actually just lose. Like, this is unbelievable. Are you ever out Cheng Ying? I should have. Effect to protect. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, this is so bad. I think this might work, maybe. Oh. Am I just dead? I'm just, d I'm just dead, man. Oh my god, dude! Already, man, we lost the game. Oh man, this is gonna be so hard today. Why is bronze difficult? Trap hole of spikes. Great. All right. Every bye bye. All right. Uh, this hand is pretty sick. Uh, but my opponent appears to have some kind of a real deck. 60 cards and 15 extra deck. We'll see though. I think it's worth it. And then just make a vibing board, I suppose. That's that's my combo. There are many like it, but this is my turn one. It's really good. Oh, come on, dude. Oh my god, come on, dude. The Nuzlocke is done after like two episodes. Oh god, man, really? I guess. Which is level five. Oh my god, yes! Yes! Shame scoop. We take shame scoops. We take shame scoops. I don't know what he was doing, but we take shame scoops. Let's reap the rewards. Bronze two, baby. Bronze two. Holy crap, we got an ultra rare. Am I just gonna get Dante here? Am I just gonna get Dante? Jesus oh, it's not so from the pack. Bronze. Cringe. Drag egg! Musket steady hands. Seer! I love that card. Okay, a musket card. Uh, we can't really do anything with that. And a Sheridan. I don't think we have sixes. Yeah, so the rewards are pretty useless, aren't they? That's crazy. <laughs> oh god, another Blue Eyes player, man. Why is there so many Blue Eyes fans? He's blinding second. I'm terrible. I'm so oh my god, I'm in danger. Oh, we got Floodgate Trap Hole, actually. I don't think we pass. All right, big turn here. Send a Blue Eyes from Hander Deck, then target a face almost so the people cannot attack while it is face up. On the field. We're gonna send Dragon Spirit of White. This thing will just never be able to attack. Okay. Alright, battle phase. Um summon this. Now he can't attack anything except the token. And then if he attacks a token, shaman triggers. So let's see if he's silly enough to do that. His monster is floating, which means he's like selecting a target. Look, now it's stopped floating. <laughs> he realized. <laughs> he realized it! He realized. Okay, do we just have like game? Uh, no, I think like it off for the tenny thing is better. Now we can discard. Kind of wild, actually. I right, declare an attack. Shaman. Target. Uh, the opponent also loses. That's not necessary. We declare. Probably game, right? Let's go! Let's go! Didn't push it What's the point? Easy victory! Tenyis to the moon! Okay, here we go. Okay, okay, okay. Please. Uh, useless. That's pretty good. Luna Light, useless. A third monk randomly? Let's go. Okay. Synchro Cracker. Love that card. Sharakusai, the wicked avatar. Based. And this thing. 
All right, well, I think Corridor and Monk are worth putting in here. All right, drawing Mare Mare might be okay here. This hand's looking kind of sus. We're going second, which is fine if we just draw any literal, literally any Tenyu. Uh, I'm scared. But he only has 11 extra deck cards. He could be bad. We're not going to make Link Monsters just yet. God, this is like full combo. How am I beating this man? Uh, Quasar, thank you for the 19. Damn, a very handsome man I see here today. Thank you. I think my hair looks looks good, right? Got a nice haircut today. Nice fade, I think. I think this is a good fade. I don't even know if it's worth playing this one out, man. This is this is this is just doomed. Uh, he okay. So you know he's only got six extra deck monsters left. Maybe maybe like there's there's not a lot of good shit remaining, and I just don't die. Okay, okay sweet. sweet. Okay okay okay. Hold on hold on hold on. We uh, there's a world where we might win this. Holy, he's gonna scythe lock us. All right, we just shotgun a Shuna here. All right, there's a chance. There's actually a chance here. Oh my god, he's elf! He doesn't realize- Oh god, he's so- Okay, I'm not trying to be toxic, but like... He's supposed to wait with the elf so that he can summon a Link monster. Now he's just summoning a random... Yeah, because you can summon Link monsters if your Poker controls a monster, but now he's just using it instantly. Dude, these are just vanilla monsters. Like, let's go. Okay, we have a chance. Alright, so before I worm lock myself... What's the effect of this thing? If you control, you can banish this and add a Tenyi card from your deck to your hand. Uh, let, let's do that. Let's go for Vishuda. Okay. Oh my god, dude. This is actually insane. We have like a lot of really good gas now. Now we can activate this corridor here. Recycling Bian, which he randomly triggered for us. I think we just get the resource off this. I get some good like synchros to summon. Oh, he's not even gonna let us play us out. He knows he's beyond dead, dude. Let's go. Oh, that's huge. That's huge. That's huge. Silver has been accessed, and you know what that means. It's time for a bundle. Ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna go for the Ash bundle here. Just keeping it nice and simple. If we hit gold, I'll go for Nibiru, I promise. All right, lots of hollows here. Lots of hollows here. Let's see if uh, we can get any good staples. Mm, no. Although this thing is removal. Remember? It's kind of bad, though. Sil Skilled White, Soul Pendulum, Trap Hole! I'm putting that in my deck. I don't care. Battery Man Solar. <laughs> Send a thunder from the deck to the grave, huh? Uh, Squamata, maybe. We'll play that. Bubble Man, Feeler. Nothing here. And a Hollow Kaleidoscope. That's useless. And over here... Nothing generic. Clove Hermos, Makani, and Holo Barastos. It's a worm. Yeah, it's also a worm. Okay, all right. We're going to play the True King. It's the F from VFD. It's his cousin. Uh, Nothing good here. Jester Confit. Special summon a Jester Confit. Just makes like Link, guys. Next up. Uh... An ultra rare shooting Quasar Dragon. Literally unsummonable. But based. Pilgrim Reaper, rank 6 mil. And a hollow Hazy Flame Sphinx. Oh my god, seriously. Happy birthday, Fafa. I can't believe you're turning 45 already. Wow. Yeah, what can less I say, man? Three, I'm just an old three. man. I'm just an old soul. Chaos Greffer, Scrap Recycler, and Drillfish. Labyrinth Archfiend and a Dart Lord Rebellion. Um, if a trap card is activated, special this card from your hand. I think we might just play this. I, I think we might just play this guy. Uh, and Chef Special Recipe is useless. That's, That's crazy. crazy. All right. Hopefully we just pull some more trap cards. Play some Control and Archfiend, you know? Uh, you and I. Mandragora. We don't even have a good rank four, do we? Uh, we can craft something with it, though can craft something. Uh, bashing shield. Maybe we just play this. All right. Pack number 10. Gagabolt Alpha, Surface, Scatter Fusion, and a Dogmaticabra. Some random generic stuff here. We need to think about our craft and then decide where to go from there. Let's, uh, let's start some deck, deck building. YouTube. 
after the looting has been done, we have uh, managed to upgrade our deck list quite significantly here. We've got a bunch of things. Our three win streak bonus has unlocked for us Protoss. Initially, I wanted to go for a extra deck monster because they're usually more impactful and easier to access and more consistent. But because we already have two copies of Heavenly Dragon Circle, that basically means we went from zero to three copies of Protoss. And Protoss floodgating your opponent and just destroying the entire field can win games literally by itself. We put in a couple of random other things as well, of course, like the corridor that we picked up, the Archfiend is nice extender, the Tragodia from that pack, the Barastos as well is also really good, which uh, reminds me, I might actually cut the pool and put that Bixie back in just to keep that water count up, because uh, that's actually kind of important. We might get the uh, bonus effect there, but yeah, this is basically the deck list here so far, trying to creep up with that trap count number because it's kind of important for the uh, Labyrinth Archfiend if we ever draw it. I really wanted to craft Boxia, but I just figured that the uh, three copies of Protoss would be better. And it's just more impact and easier to steal games with a Protoss than it is with a Boxia. So uh, let's continue the quest in silver and see if we can uh, unlock the five card win streak, which is to undismantle a card. Okay, 14 extra deck cards, 43 monsters. Uh, cards, sorry, in the main deck. 43 card main deck. 43 card main deck, 14 extra deck card. Normal summon Albaz. Set. <laughs> Set. <laughs> this is Mirror Jade, right? We can dodge with Dragon Circle. Oh my god, Protoss Call Dark is gonna go so hard, dude. This is, this is gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine. A... Okay. Super polymerization, and then we just Protoss him, probably? Damn, I wish I could uh, chain here. Albion. Did you discard anything good? Oh, Fact Veiler! Wait, no, that doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. Wait, does it? Wait, what? Lebellion. Uh, he is going into a negative Mirror Jade. Huh, <laughs> discard Ash. Wait, what? He's not making Mirror Jade. Oh, no, he is making Mirror Jade. And he gets Lebellion. All right, this is a little bit scary. Yeah, we go ball sack squad here. And we should be fine. Bruh, he's actually gonna mirror jade. Okay. Sure, I guess. Send Albion. <laughs> it might be like, oh, what? Uh, add this card to your hand. Huh! I did not know Nemesis Keystone did that. Did anyone know that Nemesis Keystone did that? All right, end phase setting with Albion. What do you think he sets here? You think he's smart enough to set Branded Fusion? Will my silver branded opponent set Branded Fusion? I told you he wouldn't set Branded Fusion. Dragon Shrine. Right, battle phase, we're going to eat some damage here. That's unfortunate. All right, ten ye, ten ye, ten ye. Come on, top deck of ten ye. Top deck, literally top deck of ten ye. Yes. Okay, we live. Wait, what? Oh, what the hell? I legitimately hate that card. Night Dragalich. <laughs> That's definitely happening. You know the uh, Jet Dragon is like legitimately an issue here? Activate to banish. Uh, and he's also forced to banish a card now. All right, let's see what his uh, Mirror Jade does here. He just activates, hard activates Retribution, fine. So now we can summon Protoss. All right, let's do it. That stupid restriction on blue eyes is actually kind of annoying. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Winnable, winnable, winnable. No! Fuck! No! Shit! Oh, damn it. All right, we're definitely just doing this here, right? We're going battle phase, we're punching you. In phase two, I'm just wondering if we summon the keystone. Why, Why is Lost, Lost Wind permanent, permanent dude? dude? No, this was like easy win. Battle phase. Okay, so we have to go Ballista Squad Tribute here. Destroy Mirror Jade. All right, Tenyi. Give me a Tenyi. That's two worms. No, it's not. All right, we need to like just not die here. Keystone is nice because it makes Nat Beast. Oh, wow. The literal best top deck, probably. It's me. Huh, <laughs> nerd. Adds Albaz. Sends Untis. Is he gonna pop my monster? Okay, good. So as long as we don't summon a light and a dark. Oh, fuck, fuck off, off, dude. Come on, Tenyi. Literally win the game off of a Tenyi here, dude. Literally win the game off of a Tenyi. Come on, baby. Tenyi! That's not bad. No, we don't have any targets. Oh, come on, dude. What the hell is that? Neither player can special monsters with a thousand or less attack. <laughs> what? That literally floodgates me. I can't summon Monk. 
<laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh! Holy crap! Alright, we're just playing Corridor Beatdown, I guess. Special summon. We've got a prison fight on our hands here, brother. <laughs> oh, Farfa, you just turned on Branded and Red. You can reborn Protoss? I misplayed. Oh, maybe it's fine. Oh, we definitely do that. Discard. Bring back Protoss. We, uh, we definitely called Dark here. Battle. Oh, no. Oh, no, dude. Oh, no. Oh, no, dude. It's over. It's actually over. Oh. Oh, no. A freaking stone, dude. Oh. No, that was our undismantled game, dude. No, we were going to get that blackout, man. Okay, it's one of the three monks. That's like we can we can take that, right? We we survived. That's that's okay. It's, it's not, not too bad. bad. won't die, surely. We won't die. I'm pretty pretty confident we'll live this. Red Eyes Insight. You are dead. You literally cannot die to this deck. What do you mean? It, it physically cannot OTK you if it activates Red Eyes Fusion. Unless it draws like, what was it? Red Eyes Flame Spirit or something? The card that targets and then deals damage equals to the... Uh... That's like the only one, which is very, very, that's a bad deck. Okay, he did do some damage. Never mind. I'm a liar. Yeah, we probably clear monsters in case there's like freaking floaters. What the fuck? <laughs> How bad is this? Bro! Actual just mirror force for six. Let's see. Is he smart enough to like trade and crash? He is. So sad, dude. I'm so sad. I can't believe we lost that. Oh my god, I've never seen that one live! Oh! <laughs> Black Meteor attack. What is it called? Flame. Flame. Uh, what's it called? I forgot the name. I forgot the name. Okay, that's completely fine. That card kind of sucks. Alright, that's cool.